Hello friends, welcome to Green PC YouTube channel. This channel will discuss about high yielding and most repeatedly asked questions for those who are preparing for medical PG entrance. If you didn't subscribe our channel so far, please do it and click the bell icon next to it to receive notifications. Feel free to click the like button and share your comments. Hi friends, welcome to Green PG YouTube channel. Today we will discuss some of the important points of chloroquine. Chloroquine is a drug that possesses largest volume of distribution. It is about greater than 1300 liters. This chloroquine prevents the conversion of heme to hemozoin. As a result of which the heme gets accumulated in the human body. This heme is toxic to a parasite called plasmodium which is responsible for causing malaria. That's the mechanism of action of chloroquine in malaria. This chloroquine is an erythrocytic schizondicide. Drug of choice for non falciparum malaria and chloroquine sensitive falciparum malaria is chloroquine. This wonder drug is used in many conditions. It includes rheumatoid arthritis, extra intestinal amoebiasis, discoid lupus erythematosus, and lepra reaction infectious mononucleosis, photogenic reaction, malaria and giardiasis. It can be easily remembered by the mnemonic red lip MG. This drug causes many side effects. The most important side effect is the bullseye maculopathy. It can also cause discoloration of the nail. This drug also precipitates porphyria. Drug of choice for malaria in pregnancy is chloroquine itself. Whereas the drug of choice for chloroquine resistant malaria in pregnancy is quinine. Usually with the quinine we give doxycycline or tetracycline or clindamycin. But in pregnancy this doxycycline and tetracycline can lead to poor bone and teeth development so it is avoided so the drug that is combined with the q9 is clindamycin thank you very much let's answer this question which of the following drug can be used for the treatment of chloroquine resistant malaria in children option a chloroquine option b doxycycline option c tetracycline option d clindamycin yep that's it guys